Hello YouTube and welcome to the Watkins Glen International for round number 21 of the MFMPRA Holiday and Cup Series. And here we are uh, for round 3 of the chase. This is going to be big for all the teams that are in the championship contention. Like our outside pole sitter Matt McMurray. By the way, the pole sitter Stefan Poppy is in the 15. And then there's the 18, McMurray in a tie for the points lead with the 09 of Bubba Fitzpatrick. Fitzpatrick starts way in the back. See, that's him right there. Other drivers. Starting up in sixth is Brendan McDowell. He's had a very good season, looking to close it out, maybe with a championship. Uh, Mark, where's Mark Edwards in the 17? He's he's moved up to fourth in the standings. He's back there. He does have Conway on the hood of that car today. So this road course could tell us a lot um, and show how good these drivers are on the different types of tracks. Um, we have a short track at the next race. That's South Boston. And then, we, and then we finish the season out with Coca-Cola Super Speedway and MFM PRA Motorsports Park. Jeez. Arnold Columbia won Pigs Creek Super Speedway. And he looks to get another win. And he's, he's still 30, back there in 33rd in the standings. But Columbia um, is open for a ride. He will automatically get a ride at the end of the season, but... Um, we're going to see what teams would like him to drive for them. Well, Stefan Papias, he's had a very up and down season. He's currently 19th in the standings. And he will bring them down for, to the green flag. And the chase continues here at Watkins Glen. And wait for it. There they go. You head down to turn one. Poppy has got a good start. Columbia as well. And those two will pull out in front here off of turn two. There's another drive that you're going to watch. The seven of Brian LaFleur Jr. He won the Cam Valley Road Course race. So look for him to have a big day today. McMurray losing ground. Or it looks like he might clear Robert Ben Kenny. Probably by the bus stop. Bus stop, uh, a lot of drivers said that's the trickiest part on the track to get through successfully. Let's see how they do it. Robert Ban up on the curb there. Looks like everything's good here. Columbia looking for the lead in the carousel. And it looks like he'll get to the inside in that Alliance Chuck Parts Dodge. No, Poppy has... Poppy has got the preferred line here, but then Columbia has it again here in the final corner. Matt McMurray right there. Like like we said, he's in the tie for the points lead. Whoa, Poppy has got a little loose. I think McDowell might have just scraped that wall there. Oh, yeah, he definitely did because he's fallen back. And there's Seth Cole now in fourth. Seth Cole comes in here 16th in the standings. Overall, he's had a pretty good season. He had the win at Hartlepool. Here, and there he is. Look at Matt McMurray. He's gotten to second. He has two goals before the season's out. Win a race, win the championship. And McMurray appears to have a car that can win this race. Let's check on Bubba Fitzpatrick in the 09. He's, he has moved up a few spots since... Since the drop of the green. Oh, that's Stephen Dillon in the back. How close he was to winning that race at Pig's Creek. And he started up in about 20th in this race. Let's. And he's a road racer, so he knows what he's doing out here. So something must have happened. Andrew Schwartz. Another driver that that uh, is pretty good on the Canadian road courses. He is Canadian himself. There's Pacioli. He comes in here sixth in the standings. Definitely not the day he would like to have. You see, there's Stephen Dillon. He's already caught back up here. He's battling with Brandon Wilcox. 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Checking up in front of him. Someone got in the wall up here and it slowed the whole field. What the heck? Tedisco. Or Jack Richards? Oh, jeez. Caution's out. Huh. What the heck? Okay, that was really weird. All right. There's Fitzpatrick. Sean Henley, they lost a lot of ground. Oh, Sean Gallagher. We saw him running up. Running up there in about 15th. What happened? Oh, someone got turned up here. Oh, it was Jordan Rossi. Connor Breton piles in. There's Ralph Green around. Dougie Shears. Look at look at look at these drivers have to check up and dodge that. There's Mark Edwards right in the middle of it. Look at all the drivers that were at the back that benefited from that. Our defending winner of this race, Angel Hernandez. Also the reigning champion, but he won't win it this year. The championship anyway. There's our road racers. Galligan. Galgan had to really check up because of that. Stephen Dillon gained a few spots. So we're going to look at our official scoring. And it's still Arnold Columbia. And man, he would love to get this 2016 another victory. Whoa! He's in the... He, he's gotten in the wall somewhere. Uh, hmm. So is Matt McMurray. I think I saw some damage. I don't think it should affect him too bad. Robert Ben in third. And he would love to finish out the season with a win. He's back in like 37th in the standings. Uh, no, 35th. Definitely not the season Robert Bam would have wanted to have. He's out of a ride as of now for next season, along with a few drivers. Oh, okay. Pit stops. Okay. With the leaders. Wow. Looks like <laughs> single out the leaders here. There's McMurray. There's LaFlair. Well, we saw Jordan Rossi around. We also saw Julian Ortiz get a little piece of it. And there's Mark Edwards, one of the drivers battling for the championship. Pit strategy for the 18 of Matt McMurray, one of the drivers in this race for the championship. Corey Williams right now is your highest running chaser. Williams is back in ninth and the uh, tenth actually now in the standings. With only 13 chase points. That means 18 points out of the out of the league coming in here. So he would love to get a good run. By the way, this is a 14 lap race. All right, here we go. We're back racing. Sebeka. Looking under Christian Baker. And Seth Cole to the lead. Under Robert Ban. By the way, Robert led him to the green. You see look look back here. Danger zone for these guys. Matt McMurray. Mark Edwards, two guys in the championship battle. Fitzpatrick's still back here. And there's Columbia with fresh tires. As of now, Bubba would probably still have the points lead, but... Here's Seth Cole leading through the carousel. Robert Band got a good run through there. There's Christian Baker without a sponsor on that car. And he's out of a ride for next season. Sebeka has a ride. So does Corey Williams. Williams will be staying with the 40. Sebeka with the 30. There's CJ Sorensen. Took a big hit at Pig's Creek with the wreck. Dropped him from 5th to 8th in the standings. Whoa, Baker! Baker just got turned! I think he got forced onto Pit Road! What happened to CJ? <laughs> CJ got in the grass and... Oh! Oh, geez, something bad happened to that zero car. Is the caution out? The caution's out. Did something else happened. There have been some weird things happening in this race. This Columbia way back. What happened to the zero? Oh, man. Okay. Here he is. He's, he just took third from, or actually kept third from Arnold Colum uh, Corey Williams. Let's see. Oh, Baker just... Oh, Sebeka drilled him. Oh, hard hit there. And that's the reason for the caution. Whoa. Brandon Bain had to swerve to dodge in there. And now Christian Baker out of the race. What a shame for the Zero team. For Johnny Davis Racing. Well, anyway...
Seth Cole is out in front and uh he and like Sebeka, John Dillon, um, along with Jesse Kaplan, they're all in the battle for the best non chaser. Julian Ortiz uh, was leading those points coming in here today. We're going to have to see if there's going to be any pit stops. Alright, let, let's see when they come around. Will there be pit stops this time? No takers yet. All right, so I think we'll be I think we'll be going green this time. Yep. All right, here we go. Seth Cole, Robert Band, Mark Sebeka, Corey Williams, Brendan McDowell. Green flag. Now that I think about it, maybe McDowell's the points leader. Here comes Sebeka. Make a makes a diving move down to the corner under Robert Band. He's gonna take the second position. There's Williams and McDowell. That's for the fourth position. I'll tell you, I don't think that strategy by Matt McMurray is working out too well. Ooh. There's that 81 back there, and he's lost. He, he didn't get a good run off that corner uh, through the S's. There's Steven Ellis going by. He goes high, and oh, someone got in the grass. I think. I think it was Williams in the 40. Here comes Williams. He's side by side with Robert Ban. That's for third, and Williams will get it. Steven Ellis with a nice move there. That's for fourth. Steven's had such a tough season. And he'll go by Robert Ban for fourth. John Worry there in the 66. He's had a very. Well, he's had a very. Not much to talk about. Boring season. 29th in the standings. Caution. There's the 33 of Filter. And man, can his chase get any worse? That's uh, the 38 of John Gray. Looks like he's... Oh, Matt's up there. I don't, know. I don't know what happened to Matt McMurray. Let's see what happened to the 38. Maybe something happened to him. Oh, wow. Here he is. He restarted 21st. And he's going to... Oh, Sharn Hill just drove off. Oh, that's a hard hit for the 38. Wow. Oh, Ortiz had to kind of slow up there to dodge him. Well, where's the 33? I'd like to know why he's on pit road. Maybe he just came on or... All right. Yeah, he just came on. I don't know. So now we're under caution again. At least this race isn't hasn't had the bad wrecks like last season. If you don't remember last season, man, that was a <laughs> there was some bad wrecks in that race. Well, anyway, how about why does it say Alex Filter's the leader? <laughs> I don't know. Well, anyway, that 62 car he would love to get another win. Mark Zabeka would love to get his first win. Stephen Ellis would love to get his first win the season as well. Corey Williams there in fourth. Look at Robert Band. He's falling back a bit. And this five, six, seven, eight, ninth. And Ben Stern in tenth. He's last in the points coming in here. Just a tough season for the 07. They will not be returning here next season. Alright, uh. Alright, we'll start the video with the green flag.